there is simply no other event where you can meet such a huge cross-section of the ICT for development community in such a short space of time. WSIS is very important because it provides an opportunity for uh, countries worldwide as well as uh, private companies, uh, non-government organizations to come together. For us it is uh, uh, the annual gathering, a possibility of meet, uh, uh, to meet our partners, uh, implementation partners, to talk through uh, uh, the challenges which they're facing. I think uh, uh, it's very important for any government and uh, any uh, organization from private sector. It's a, a, a representation from a huge number of countries, uh, different types of organizations, different experiences. It's very important for us in UNDP to be part of this process. The World Summit of Information Society is a very important event. And uh, in this kind of event where you have the private sector, the government sector and the non-government sector get together on the same table and discuss the sustainable development. It's clear that this is the platform uh, for private sector, public sector, academia and, another, and a number of NGOs to come together to find solutions to drive ICT around the world. It's very useful also to see what other countries are doing, to get some fresh ideas about what are good projects, what are the successful projects, how can you replicate something that somebody else has done. It's great to hear from the uh, distinguished speakers, ministerial level, ICT level, the role of ICT in their countries, how they are deploying it, and how um, if they, uh, they are tackling their issues and problems in the current world that we live in. The meetings we have with uh, our colleagues here in this uh, forum actually help uh, shape our, a lot of our plans, uh, help us uh, avoid some of the obstacles, uh, get us to overcome the challenges, not easily, but wisely. With WESIS, what happens is you meet the ITU leaders, you meet all the United Nations leaders, the UN departments, many ministers come, uh, many people from their countries and you have private industry here together. So we get together a number of people that can not just talk about ideas, that actually have the capabilities to make them happen in their countries. And many of the ideas we've been able to talk about are actually starting in practice today. So it's a very powerful forum that drives implementation. It creates an opportunity for, for discussion, for networking, for debate. And, and I think for many, civil society, members of civil society, they often don't have that opportunity at home. And it's ironic actually that you often have to travel to Geneva in order to have a chance to grab your Minister of Communications and, 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 and talk to them. So I think that is a real value of, of events like, like this. Um, over the past five years I've seen how WSIS has expanded under the leadership of the ITU, lots of wonderful things are happening. Cybersecurity, great progress has been made and collaboration is visible. Greater visibility has been given to developing countries. We find WSIS Forum very dynamic and interactive. And what we came here for is to share our experiences in the ICT area, to share it with other countries. Everybody's learning in this field and it's important for us to show our case to the rest of the world and we would love to see the best examples that's happening around the world to see what we can learn from. I believe that in the 21st century, um, information and the sharing of information uh, will be key uh, to a globalized world. Uh, and I think that that's, this is a wonderful platform to be in.